inverted flat spin. And trust me when I tell you, you have to purposely want to get into this maneuver because it involves pushing the stick all the way forward, having the power in full, having outspin aileron and holding those inputs. Not something that's going to happen by accident. Okay. All, all right. right, you ready? Yeah. Okay, here we go. Yep. So I'm rolling yep. and pushing. Power out. Still got to get the, out. Get that nose up there. The stall. Yeah, no, just be patient. Let the stall come okay. to you. Okay. Push stick forward, right rudder, good. Let okay. it get going, let it get going, good. Now bring okay. in the power. Power. Stick to the right. Stick to the right. Forward, keep the stick forward and forward, to the right. I see. Full power. There you go. Yeah. Inverted All flat right. spin. So All right. power, aileron, rudder, stick. Right. Look at that. All right. Woo! Oh, man. That was a good one. <laughs> That's a, the inverted flat spin. That was, uh, the inverted flat was far more uncomfortable than the inverted regular. Yeah, well, you, you got two G-forces going on. Yeah. You've got a little bit of negative from just hanging upside down, yeah. and you've got a lateral G from the spinning, right? Pushing well, then you've it. also got the roll of the yaw like in yeah. opposite direction. Which so we're, and which really we're trying confusing. to, that's, that's why you do out, out, out aileron out stick, to try to stick, flatten yeah. the roll out as much as possible. Yeah, that makes sense. So here we go. Pull the nose up, slow the airplane down, and roll inverted. Now I'm pushing the stick forward to get into an inverted stall. Inverted stall, right rudder, stick forward. Now stick to the outer corner and I add the power. This is as aggravated as you can get in inverted spin. Now the recovery is just like any other spin we use the pair method. Power off, aileron's neutral, opposite rudder, stick back through the neutral position, and the spin is over. And we recover back to level flight. And that was the inverted flat spin. It's a lot of fun, but it's not something you're going to do by accident in any airplane ever.